This episode of Turnstile is all about toys. So Marcy and I are at Disney Springs today, no joke, and we are here, it's bright and early. Very early, before the stores even open. Before the stores even open, and we are here to pick up the new Tiki Room Anniversary Pop Vinyl, which is coming out today. Three different locations it's showing up at. It's showing up at um, the Pin Trader, showing up at the Polynesian Hotel, and it's also showing up at the Magic Kingdom. So we chose the most accessible, which was coming out here to Disney Springs to pick up the pop. See, I, I think there's going to be a lot of other people that are also looking to add to their collection. Yeah, I can't wait to see how many people are actually in line. Let's go check it out. Toy chest. It's a whole like miniature play area, but it it looks like the toy box from Toy Story. That's really cool. Yeah, a whole play set for Buzz Lightyear right inside here. Zerg, aliens. What do you got there? So you can dress up as Woody the Cowboy or Buzz Lightyear. So we are currently enduring the hot Florida summer. Florida summers are here and you know it if you're, if you're out and about because the sun is blazing. But we have gone from Disney Springs to Altamont Springs. Um, I don't know that we've ever shot a video out this way, but there is a special Toy Story Land event happening at the Altamont Springs Mall. So that's what we're gonna go check out in just a minute. Are you excited for uh, the Toy Story Land? I am. I mean, that's soon. That's in a couple of days that yeah, it's going to open. Yeah, just in a few days. A whole new area. Are you guys excited? I know you are. Let us know in the comments section. And we are going to check out what's going on here at the Altamont Springs Mall. I've been here a total of maybe like five minutes and I've already lost Marcy in a mall. This is bad news. Right, so she's not in Hot Topic. Where could she be? For the life of me, I don't know where she made it out to. So many stores. Alright, here's the bookstore. Still no Marcy. Can't seem to find her anywhere. Dang, where could she be? Alright, there you are. You found me. What'd you find? Besame. Riley Rose just started carrying Besame Cosmetics and that is why Brandon lost me because I didn't know we had a store locally. And here it is, right in my mall. So this is a eyeshadow palette that you can get. Oh wow. So this That's is cool. all the seven dwarfs in mini lipsticks. She also did a collaboration with Agent Carter. So this looks like a passport, but it's an eyeshadow palette. But Probably the coolest one from that particular collection, well, that you can still get, is her compact. And got like a decoding. So it looks like we did well getting up early this morning. There's still like no people here. 
We should point out too that this is all put on by Box Lunch, right? Uh, which is a really cool company. Uh, it reminds me of it's in the same vein as that, like the Think Geek and all that stuff. So we're gonna check that store out as well. But first, maybe we should check out some of the Toy Story stuff. I just want to say hi. How are you today? Good afternoon. Doing good. You guys excited for Toy Story Land? Very excited. Very excited. You excited? I am very excited as well. It's sure. a little bit hot out. I'm not sure what you guys think about just that. Just a tad bit. How does trying not to melt? <laughs> That's what I figured. <laughs> Awesome. So we can stand in a life-size Buzz Lightyear box. All right, go for it. Action figure. The closable arm. That's really cool. I'm Marco Bongiorno, and I led the team that put together this Pizza Planet truck build. It's you... been going about seven years. And this is a fan project. It is. Yeah, we've uh, originally built it with the intention to just like go on a pizza delivery, and then it kind of snowballed into we we ended up going to Pixar. We got to meet a lot of people, we've done a couple road trips, we've been in the Hollywood Christmas Parade, we're here in Florida, this is the first time it's set tire in other in another state, but with no air conditioning it's a little rough with this humidity, Ooh. but uh, we're looking into doing a whole lot more with it. My friends and I were all about two years into college and we thought, you know, we grew up with these movies, like I feel like, you know, we, before we hadn't seen any movie, or seen any trucks that look similar enough, so we're like, Let, I think I think it's our, our chance to try it, let's try it, and then we saw the movie and we're like, we have to do this, otherwise someone else is going to do it, and we got to do it right. So, and where can people follow you? Give me that information. Where PizzaPlanetTruck.com is our main website. Pizza Planet Truck on Instagram and Pizza Plane Truck on Twitter because Pizza Planet Truck is one letter too long. What'd you get in the bag? Let me show you. opening soon. So there's loads of new t-shirts. Um, we got Pizza Planet, which is really cool. Box Life also had some limited edition Toy Story Land pins and a green Army Man pop vinyl limited edition for the event as well. It's from a regular choice. There are shoes to match. I didn't see them yet, but they do exist. Really cute purse. I kind of like my accessories, but I really like the design of that. How perfect is that? It's a really cool design because you know I love Edna. Got Wilderness Explorers, by and large. Ponyo hairbrush. This is a cool button down shirt. Totoro. Kiki's delivery service. So, what an absolute crazy day for our toys. We were all over the place. We were all over the place looking and just celebrating toys. We got our pop finals this morning. We went to box lunch mm -hmm. this afternoon. We went from Disney Springs, Elkmont Springs. Mount Springs. And this is just a really, really fun day. Um, and I think it only served to make us more excited for Toy Story, Toy Story Land, yeah. which is opening so soon, Hi. so soon. And we've waited so long for it. And as I said before, guys, how excited are you guys for Toy Story Land? What are you looking to do first? Are you looking to check out the um, rides, the food? <laughs> That's for me. The merchandise. The merchandise. <laughs> Let us know in the comments section below. And before we go, I definitely recommend you come out and check out, if you have a box lunch near you, check out all the cool merchandise they have out there, especially the Pixar Toy Story stuff. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, please click the like button and don't forget to subscribe to Retro Spectrum.